Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another Leg Geeks Backyard video. Uh, so today, I'm going to take a break from working on Celica uh, because it kind of... Uh, I'm fed up with it. It's a long story. Anyways, um, today I'm going to show you guys how to tune your BMW with Chaos Calibrations, CC Flasher Suite, as well as their own in-house tuning cable. Uh, so first, you're going to need a laptop with Windows. You're going to need their flashing cable or any flashing cable of your choice. However, I do definitely recommend to get their flashing cable off their website to avoid any uh, any discrepancies or any issues with tuning. Uh, you're going to need your set of keys. And for safety, you're going to need your trickle charger. Um, this is definitely recommended because um, you definitely don't want to end up messing one. I'm going to link this one down below. I think it was like $30 on Amazon. So, yeah, uh, let's get started. Okay, hey guys, uh, welcome to my trunk. Um, it's very messy. I have my trusty uh, tool case holding up my uh, trunk lid. Uh, well, the battery cover lid. So basically, we're just going to set up my Noku uh, trickle charger. I have it plugged into my extension cable. So first things first, we're just going to undo the uh, terminals, make sure they're nice and open. And then I'm just going to take my negative lead here. I'm going to put it right on to the, the terminal, make sure it's nice and secure. And I'm going to take my positive terminal, and then I'm just going to kind of sneak it in there and then hook it up. Um, so, yeah, that's really about it. And then we're just going to come here to the, the Noku. It's a little hard to see, but um, basically it's a solid red. Um, it's going to pick it up as flashing on the camera, but you're just going to want to set it to 12 volts. Unless you have an actual AGM battery. Um, I searched up my battery. This is an interstate battery. It is not AGM. I thought it was AGM. And when I had it on my AGM setting, um, you can see there, it actually didn't charge the car. That's why the red light isn't on. Um, so it wasn't charging the battery. Well, now it came on, but it's, it's not going to work. Anyways, what you're going to want to do is just have it set to uh, 12 volts. Just search up your battery's um, model name and then just search up what type of battery is my battery is not an agm so i just have it at 12 volts and boom so your trigger charger is set up and then now you can be ready to tune there and all that this is not my usual screen recording um you guys are going to get the laptop view um so got our cable plugged in we got our trigger charger set up so um basically you're going to get an email after you purchase your tune it's going to include the cc flasher suite you're just going to unzip the file and then you have your two um, installation instructions and your upload tune. These are very important to look over. Please look over them. Um, but I already have my CC flasher set up. The main thing I do want to point out here is um, I'm using Windows 11, which is fine. Um, you're just gonna you're just gonna right click on your start menu. You're gonna come to Device Manager, and then you're gonna wait for that to load. When it pops up, you're gonna look for Ports and Com right here. And then for me, my USB serial port, um, you're going to see a lot of them, and you're probably going to try to wonder which one. The best way that I find to find out which one it is, is that if we go to details over here, uh, sorry, if we go to events over here, you're going to see the last time it was actually installed. So this is the first time I actually plugged it in, which was uh, June 6th. So this is the most recent device, so that's how I know that it is my flashing cable. Um, then we're just going to go to port settings over here. We're going to go to advance. And then you're just going to make sure that your latency timer is at one millisecond. That is very important. You're just going to hit OK. And then you should be good. So that is very important for your setup. Um, now I'm going to show you guys especially how to get into it and the tuning process. So let's go there. Now I'm just going to keep it rolling because I don't feel like starting another video. Anyways, so boom, right there we have our CC flasher. We're just going to run it, wait for it to load. Um, at this point, you're just going to want to, you know, look, see, it pops up right there. Just going to put in your key and my memory seat is, you know, remembering where I am. And you're just going to put the car into the on position. And I'm going to move my seat back. Okay, shut up. Everything is turning on. You guys are going to hear my radio. Don't worry about that check engine light. I, at light, I have a vacuum leak on my car. Um, and I'm too lazy to fix it. Anyways, um, I'm just wait for my car to turn on. 
um, because my CarPlay is going to start making noise. And there we go. Okay. So that's off. All right, cool. So now we're going to just, this is so hard to do with one hand. Okay. Anyways, this is a comprehensive guide. We're just going to take our cable, find OBD port down there. Take out my sensor. And then I'm just going to plug it in right there. And then lights will come on. So now we're going to come here and just go to identify ECU. So, boom, it's identified my ECU. My car is beeping at me. Shut up. Okay. Anyways, boom, that's my ECU. Um, so my voltage is 12. It's detected. It's good. Sorry, there's a there's an idiot on my block. Okay. Anyways, as I was saying, so boom, we're detected now. If this is your first time tuning, mine is not. First time tuning, we're just gonna do a full download of the ECU, and then you're gonna send that off to get your tune done. Um, so basically once it's plugged in, you just do full download and you're going to leave it. This is very important, especially why I mentioned having the trickle charger. I think my full download took 45 minutes, somewhere around there. So you're just going to want to leave it. Um, so now this is in the case of actually uploading your tune. Um, so I'm going to show you guys how to do that now. So you're going to see the upload tab. You're just going to click there and then you're going to do load to actually, sorry. You're just going to identify ECU, make sure everything is still good, normal operation. Then you're going to go to load tune and then boom. So that's, don't worry about all those other files. It's my midterms. And then boom, you're just going to click. This is my most recent tune um, with throttle enhancement, which I didn't get to try out yet. Um, and then we're just going to go to open. So as you can see, it's now loaded now. And then we're just going to do a full upload. So it's preparing, and then we're just going to wait, and then boom. You're just going to start seeing a whole bunch of things happening. That's fine. And then, as you can see there, there's a little green thing, sign that says uh, cable connected. Everything is good. That might have been there before. I don't know, but it's green. Anyways, um, so now the upload is going to happen. So now is a good time to just, you know, get out the car and then, you know, just let the ECU do its thing. All right, guys. I, uh, I, I clipped my mic on my shirt, so I don't know if this sounds different. But, yeah, the tuning is finished. So uh, as we can see, it, uh, it took 14 minutes and 53 seconds. Uh, see, if you can see here, my voltage just dropped a little bit, uh, which is fine. That's why you need the trickle charger, but it says... Flashing full complete, uh, normal operation. So we're just going to close out of the program. And then unplug our cable. I'm going to throw this in my passenger seat. Throw my laptop in the back. Oh, shit. Anyways, and then we're just going to come here. And then we're just going to unplug our trickle charger. And then, yeah. I'm gonna close my trunk and then eh. and then let's go for a little uh little uh, test drive so i'm just gonna take out my key i'm gonna pop it back in give it a little bit and then i'm gonna start it so now we are all good and yeah So now my car is idled up nice and good. So let's take it for a little test drive. Let's see if I can feel any difference. If you guys hear any rattling, okay, I'm a mess. But if you guys hear any rattling or anything at all, don't worry. That's my exhaust. I snapped my hanger. The car is a mess right now. But let's just try to focus on the, uh, the throttle enhancement. Um, so this is like the first, this is the initial revision of it. So I might not feel it as much according to Daniel. Um, like I said, they're still working out things with the tune, so let's just take it for a quick spin, 
and then I'm gonna see. But right now my phone's at 20%, so let's see how fun this is gonna be. I'm gonna try to find a place. Where did I put you guys last time? We're like, oh, we didn't get messed up. Can I should I just put you guys here? And then hope like it doesn't just stop recording. Alright, but then if I break, you guys are gonna fall. Nian, should have got some tape. Alright, well, you guys are gonna oh wait, no, but I put you by my shifter last time. Alright, you know what? You know what? You know what? You guys are going to stay right right here. I'm going to put the seatbelt. I'm going to put you guys in like the seatbelt position area. All right, that's the that camera nice. All right, eh, eh. You get the buckles in the way, but you guys are secure-ish. So I'm going to pop your manual. All right, let's see. You guys are going to hear my neighbors. Oh, yeah, so like, it's a little more <laughs> nice. I don't know if you guys can hear me. So the, the car, the, the car's a little more throttle happy. Um, shut up. Dude, I, I clapped the pothole on with my car and, uh, yeah. So something in the front's rattling. I, I don't know. This car's a mess, but yeah, the car is definitely a little more throttle happy. Um, yikes! There's my tractor. This shit. Come on, people! I got a car to test. I mean, I'm in Mexico, but yeah, I don't know. Hopefully, you guys can hear me. Hopefully, it's picking up the car. But yeah, it, it definitely is a lot more peppy. Yeah, it definitely feels a bit faster. The throttle response is nicer now. So, I mean, yeah, this this, this is fun. I I I don't know. I'm trying to use like big big people words, you know, like like big words that make me look like you know I'm I'm an educated YouTuber. But I don't know. This rattling is just annoying. I don't know how much other car you guys can get. I mean, it's okay. Yeah, it's definitely like when you're on the first. I don't know. It's like a weird way to describe it. I'm gonna leave this all in the video because I'm dumb. But like, when you like when you're first on the throttle, like it just it just pulls a little bit more. Like the only way I could describe it is that. The oh, let me just close my windows. The only way I could really describe it is that my throttle body is just like so. Like initially, it would open right because you know it has to be a little open. But then once the throttle enhancement kicks in, it just flings it open a little bit more. Like I feel like that's what it is. Well, I mean that that is how throttle enhancement works to my knowledge, but like. It's just like, it's just nice. Like you, you feel the car feels more peppy. That that that's really it. it, it the car feels more peppy. Um, yeah, that, that's really about it. The car just feels nice and peppy. Hopefully my phone doesn't die. I'm gonna try to get home. And you hear my car just goes. Blah, 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 blah. That's all you hear. I smell the car too. And then uh, let 
maybe I can show you guys my neighbor's car that just rolled in. I'm going to ask him about it. It's a E90. It's an E92, E90. It's, it's an E90 X car. It's a M3. Got a little bit of a boo-boo. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Um, but yeah, throttle enhancement, definitely, um, it's peppy. It's nice, uh, especially for the first revision. Uh, I'm pretty sure we're going to get to fine tune it. But this this video is not really focused towards that. I, I'll have a review video out. Depending on how things work, you may see this video first and then the review video or the other way around. Um, this is mainly focused towards just uploading your tune, getting it, and just how to get started. So um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video please comment like subscribe um i'm trying to get better with every video so yeah hopefully we can uh make something out of this i still need to upload content on the celica um but yeah and that's that's my neighbor's uh that that just rolled in um got a little bit of fender damage i don't know how much the video got about it but uh yeah i'm gonna go talk to him about it and see what he's see what he says but uh, peace.